Hello, today we're going to do a review of um, Battle Valley for the Amstrad CPC, which you can see was a load of shit. Basically, this game should have been made for the Amstrad. I mean, if you've ever, ever played the Commodore 64 version, then playing this is a shit experience because this was nothing like the Commodore 64 version. It was way better than this shit. Look at it. One thing you notice straight away, the fucking background don't move. And the graphics look worse than the Commodore 64. The Commodore 64 version was brilliant graphic wise in every way. Okay the game is hard to play but this is just shit. They just ain't taking no time for this one. I mean okay the color. It's graphic background graphics the weapons they use. Quite nice. Well it's nice and right. But that just don't make the game. The old thing makes the game. And this is just horrible. Look at the tank, you can't even see the wheels turn around, the tracks turn around. It's a horrible game. And just wait till you see the helicopter. What the first what will you have to do? Well, I'll stop here and get some ammo. I think this fills up the helicopter ammo, not the tanks. We've only got three shells left, so we've used them all. And you use half of them shells just to get the speed right. So we're out of shells now, so. Oh, severe damage to the tank. Right, I was going to say, the object of the game... Then I've got to go back, I might just go back and get the helicopter out now. I think it's top stop two missiles from taking over the world or something, or... I don't know. So basically what you've got to do is get your tank and clear, clear the ground, which we'll fail to do because we ran out of shells for the helicopter to come over and put a bridge put a bridge up it's pretty difficult to play but let me just see and that's basically it so we're going to go back now get the helicopter hopefully no one will this shit will kill us we're going to have to get back by the others to take so slow so slow when you have said, why couldn't they have done a better job? So annoying when you see this crap. Oh. I think once again, this was rushed to get out. Because it's very buggy, this game. When I remembered it, buying it for the actual, it was very buggy. So we're going to take out a little to now. And look how crap that looks. What the f it just clashes with the fucking mountains. The mountains don't know. It's just shit. Fucking crap. This is for the Amstrad. Why did they even bother with it? Fucking hell. Atrocious graphics. Oh shit, I'm gonna get blown up. Get out of here, pop with that. It's slow, come on. You don't get Every time you crash, you lose the time, your time limit goes down, so it gets harder and harder. So, what we can do, yes. So, we're going and get our bridge fixed so the tank can go over it. Oh, just got a light damage, so nothing to worry about at the moment. Right, let's see if we can stop and get this, get that winch out. This really is a waste of time. I like, can't be fucking bothered just trying to line it up. Back it, reach it in, reach that in, let's go and get the bridge. God, this is appalling. Oh, fucking hell! So, go and take our helicopter out again. And do exactly the same thing. Wait 10 years to get over it because it's so fucking slow. I think the only thing decent about this music ain't half bad. No, not a patch on the Commodore 64's SID chip. No way. 
in this gym, but it's all right. You know what you can say for the fucking game itself. God, it's so it's taking forever to get over here. Just look how poor it is. God. Well, luckily it was only a budget game, so I think it was about two ninety nine. But it's the same price as the Commodore sixty four as well. So that was ten times better than this shit. I think this was programmed by a company called Hewson. Did the Cybernoid games? Wish they weren't bad. This. Hit it. Tremendous fucking graphics. Okay, the colour's okay, but that's it. Right, this is a bridge. What we've got to do, hover over it. If we can, get our winch out. Oh, fuck's sake, I'm sort of over it. Fucking, what's wrong with this fucking thing? Why are they responding? Fucking terrible response. Fucking yeah, hell, this is terrible. Oh fucking hell, we're gonna die, shit. Fucking severe damage now. Shit. Right, fucking turn! Fucking... Oh, this, I hate this bit. Fucking trying to line it up, that's it, here we go. Fuck! Now we've got to go get our fucking bridge again. Shut the shit out of. Yeah, there we go. One more hit, and we're probably dead. Critical damage now. Let's see if we can shoot that, yes. Critical throw. Come on. Fucking hell, stop wasting time, will you piece of shit? Right, here we are again. Let's have another go. Fuck. Ah. Right, hover over it. Get our bridge up again. Let's see if we can. Come on. Oh, in Fuck! Oh, look, there's a bug. There's a bug. Look at that. That's terrible. We don't need a tank. We'll get our helicopter again. Go through that crap again. 11 minutes now. We got. We ain't gonna do this. Luckily. So what you basically do? Once you send the tank back over over the bridge, you find another HQ. You can find. I think you find. Three HQs each, left and right, so six in total. I think don't quote me on that. Ain't played such a long time, but and once you do that, and you get the missile. I think I never could complete this game. It's too bloody hard. Even on the Commodore 64, I couldn't complete it. Bloody old game. Mind you, looking at this, I don't even fucking want to play it. Shit. Avoid all this crap again just so we can fix a bridge for the tank to get over. I'm not going to bother with that fucking thing, waste of time. Um, what else can I say about it? Not a lot. Bloody hell. Really thought they would have made this at least actually playable for the Amstrad. This is just absolute crap. Oh, we just got here. Fuck, I need like damage though. Right, let's see if we can do it this time. There we go. So, oh fucking hell, why didn't it respond? It's not responding. Oh, for fuck's sake, got to line it up. Oh, gee. Fucking hell, come on. Fucking crap. He's going for oh. Yes, here we go. Right, here we go. Now, fly up like that and get our tank. Right. Uh, so, as I say, every time you lose your helicopter or your tank, I think you lose time about three minutes. Right, yes, it's close. So there we go, I'm going to pop this shit. Crap. 
Fuck! Not only that, I just got blown up. My fucking monitor went off. Oh my god, what's going on with it now? Look at the tank! What the fuck is going on? What is it? It's alright when it goes wrong like that. Oh god, here comes the bugs. Yeah, the bugs are starting. Because that is crap. I remember we've done that on the fucking original version. Programming error. And I thought they'd learn better than that. That is just crap. Already I've seen two glitches. I've only played the game what? Not even ten well, just over ten minutes and there's already two glitches. I don't know if they're melting to spoke unless that's a glitch, I don't know, but that was like that anyway, so that's probably down to I can't be bothered to program the mount is going over. So here we go, over What the fuck? What the fuck was there? Ah oh, fuck this crap. This is the end of this shitty review. I've had enough. Goodbye.